addition to Josh Freeman of the Bucks, hopeful the Lions, who last week snapped 17 in a row losing in the division, now they're trying to snap 26 in a row losing on the road. And when LeGarrette Blunt, the rookie, goes, boy, this young man runs hard. 39 yards, it was the Bucks who take a 14-10 lead at the half. And anytime you get good running like that, you get great blocks. Maurice Stovall and Mike Williams. You out front, number 19, clearing a path for Blunt to get to the end zone. Now we're 17 all, Tommy, three and a half to go in the fourth quarter. Josh Freeman, he's done well late in the games. Mm. Rolling left, and he looks for Mike Williams, number 19, a key reception, <laughs> setting up a field goal, 20 to 17. Drew Stanton, remember he's the third string quarterback Detroit to Calvin Johnson. Had a big game, 23 yards. Remember their kicker, Hanson, kicked that forever hurt earlier in the year. Dave Rayner at the gun, tied, good. 28 yards, overtime, tied at 20. Lions win the toss. Maurice Morris. Mo definitely. Mo Morris, 15 carries, a buck nine. Calvin Johnson. How about this catch on the ball from Stan? Yeah, a third down and eight, and look at where he plants the toe. The only reason that this is complete is that he put the toes down first and didn't let the heel hit the ground. So the Lions come up the field, and Dave Rayner for the winner. Good. Right down the middle for Jim Schwartz. You know, the Lions, they've done a good job every week, even though they don't have a lot to show for it, and they really put a hole in the Bucs' playoff hopes. 23 to